Welcome to Align Christ-Centered Yoga. My name is Linda and I'll be guiding our practice today. And today's scripture is a memory verse flow. We are connecting scripture with breath and movement. Today's scripture verse comes to us from the prophet Malachi. And through Malachi, God says to us, but for you who fear my name, the sun of righteousness shall rise with healing in its wings. You shall go out leaping like calves from the stall. When we memorize scripture, it's not just so that we can say we memorize scripture, it's so that it can actually impact our lives moment to moment and minute to minute. So real quickly, I'm gonna break this down. For you who fear my name, in this case, he is talking about fear. A lot of us are really uncomfortable with this, but all the preceding verses are about a God of destruction, a God of great power, of great might, who tears down and destroys things that come between him and his people. The sun of righteousness shall rise with healing in its wings. The winged sun is an image in the Near East that represents divinity, that represents kings, that represents royalty. So God is using this pagan symbol. He is redefining it as his own. The sun of righteousness shall rise with healing in its wings. He will hear, he will heal those who fear his name. And the result of that, you shall go out leaping like calves from the stall, fully healed, young again, excited and ready to go. He's connecting fearing his holy name with healing, with joy. For you who fear my name, the son of righteousness shall rise with healing in its wings and you shall go out leaping like calves from the stall. Find your sitting bones. Rock a little bit side to side, front to back. Engage the abdominals. Close your eyes if you're comfortable with that. Begin to find your breath. So notice where you begin with your breath today. Is your breath fast? Is it slow? Is it deep? Is it shallow? Begin to lengthen the breath, breathing in through the nose, breathing down the body, filling the lungs, the rib cage, the diaphragm. And exhale, drawing the belly in, softening the rib cage and emptying the lungs. Back and forth here a few times, just feeling the breath begin to release the body and notice what's going on in the body today. So today will be a practice of sun salutations. As the sun of righteousness rises with healing in its wings. How might you need to modify those? Give yourself permission to make the practice work for you. I invite you to take two more breaths here, letting the day fade away. Inviting the release of the tension in the body. A deep breath in, let the arms rise up and overhead and exhaling, bring those arms out about halfway. Connecting with breath, begin to find seated cow. So seated cat, you're just drawing that belly in. It's a little bit of a crunch. Tucking your chin, rounding your spine. And then that inhale, the hips tilt forward. The chest rises, the gaze rises. There's an arch in the back, seated cow back and forth here a few times. Seated cat, seated cow. And one more. The hands come down, let them rise up. I invite you to stay here. Start with the arms a little bit wide. As you inhale, push those arms up from underneath. So you're using your serratus muscles here. You're just gonna push those arms up. 
And then exhale the arms down. Same thing, but this time maybe the palms meet. Again, can you extend those arms? As you do that, as you push up with breath, can you also engage the muscles of the abdominals? Hip to hip, belly button draws in and up a little bit, rib cage softens, exhale down. So two more times here, arms rising and falling, using the breath with the movement, adding the scripture verse. For those who fear my name, the sun of righteousness will rise with healing in its wings. And you will go out leaping like a calf from the stalls. I invite you to meet me in table. Bring any props that you have towards the front of the mat. Hands underneath the shoulders, knees underneath the hips. Find cat and cow here. Exhale into cat. Inhale into cow. Noticing how the sensation shifted now that you're on your knees. And then from here, but for you who fear my name, the sun of righteousness will rise with healing in its wings. You shall go out leaping like calves from the stall. One more breath here. Bring your hands forward. Go ahead and bring the shoulders over the wrist. Find that kneeling plank. Come down to the mat. So let's explore low cobra and then upward facing dog as your back bending options. And sphinx is always an option as well. With low cobra, those arms are out, round the shoulders a little forward as the chest comes off the mat, maybe just about an inch. And then lift the chest up, push the chest through the shoulders. Low cobra. Exhale down. So try that a couple of times. Rotate those shoulder blades around and under as you rise. One more time. If you'd like to explore upward facing dog, you're just going to take those hands down towards the rib cage, come up to the tops of your feet and your hands. Those hips are going to come forward. The legs are off the mat. And then from here, if you're going into downward facing dog, just roll over your toes. So everybody find your first downward facing dog. Everybody, sometimes I forget that I'm on YouTube. You and me, let's find downward facing dog. Go ahead and rotate through your um, hips a little bit. Press your heels towards the floor. Deep breath in, heels rise. Exhale, heels come down to the mat. Notice how downward facing dog feels. Shake your head out, no and yes. Draw the gaze forward, bring the feet in between the hands. Find your first forward fold. Hold on to your elbows, rock a little bit side to side. Find your breath. At the top of the head, begin to reach a little more towards the mat. Maybe you straighten out those legs a little more as the hamstrings reach up into the hips. Then hands to shins, come up halfway. Exhale down. Deep breath in, rise all the way up. Let those arms come wide. Again, just round those shoulders under a little bit. Meet me in a little bit of a back bend. Inhaling, arms rise up, extended mountain. Exhale, hands to heart. So find mountain pose, so those feet are gonna be hip width apart. You're gonna 
Step evenly into the feet at the base of the big toe, little toe, and heel. Maybe there's some toe action going on. You're pressing through the base of the big toe and the little toe. Maybe those middle three toes actually lift. Engage the muscles of the abdominals. Let the shoulders get a little heavy here. And then finding this sun salutation. The arms rise up, palms together, push up with the breath. Exhale, forward fold, hinge at the hips. Softly let the body fold. Hands to shins, raise the body about halfway up. Top of the head reaches forward, hips reach back. Imagine a tabletop back here. Exhale down. Step into that right foot, that left leg will come back. Drop that knee to the mat, inhale up. Let's do cactus arms as we open up into that back bend. Deep breath in, arms rise. Exhaling, hands come down to the foot. Raise the back leg, front leg comes to the back. Come down to the mat. Find your back bend. Come back through table. Meet me in downward facing dog. Stay here for a breath. So we're halfway through that sun salutation. Go ahead and bring that left leg forward. Back knee comes down. Rise into your back bend. Inhale, arms up. Exhale. Go ahead and bring the hands um, to either side of the foot. Raise that back leg. Bring the back leg front. Forward fold. Hands to shins, rise up halfway. Exhale down. Come all the way up, mountain pose. Reach, reach, reach. Find that back bend. Extended mountain, hands to heart, find breath. So that's a little bit modified, but we'll just, uh, we'll keep playing with it a little bit as we go throughout the day or throughout the practice here. Find your breath, notice where you are. We're gonna to begin to connect this with scripture as well. Take two breaths here, notice what you notice. Deep breath in, arms rise. For those of you who fear my name, find your back bend. The sun of righteousness will rise with healing in its wings. Arms rise. And you will go out, forward fold, like calves leaping from the stall. Hands to shins, rise up halfway. Exhale down, this time leave the left leg there. Bring the right leg back. Drop to the knee. Bring the arms up. Find your back bend. Inhale the arms up. Exhale, hands to either side of the foot. Raise the back leg. Bring the front foot to the back. Meet me in plank. Maybe you're in chaturanga. Maybe you're in kneeling plank. Find your back bent or find your um, way back down to the mat. Let's add the scripture verse. For those of you who fear my name, find your back bend. The sun of righteousness will rise with healing in its wings. And find your way back to downward facing dog. And you will go out leaping like calves from the stall. Find your breath. On that next inhale, the right leg is going to rise up and draw forward in between the hands. Back knee comes down. Come into your uh, back bend here. Exhaling, bring the hands to either side of the foot. Raise that back leg, bring the back foot to the front. 
meet me in forward fold. Shake your head out no and no, settle here. Adding the scripture verse as we rise up in the mountain, hands to shins, come up halfway. For those of you who fear my name, come on down, rise into your mountain, arms wide. The sun of righteousness will rise with healing in its wings. Hands together, exhale to heart, forward fold. And you will go out like calves leaping from the stall. Hands to shins, rise up halfway, exhale down, press into that right foot, left leg comes back. Come into that low lunge, arms rise, find your back bend. Release. Raise that leg up, come into a high lunge. Find your back bend. Arms rise and hands come to either side of the foot. Front foot comes to the back. Meet me in plank. From plank, choose your flow back to downward dog. Join me in that scripture verse. For those of you who fear my name, the sun of righteousness will rise with healing in its wings. And you will go out like calves leaping from the stall. Check in with your downward facing dog. What do you notice? Taking a deep breath in. The right leg will rise high. Gaze forward, foot comes all the way through the hands, back knee comes down. Come up into your lunge. Find your back bend. Release, hands come to either side. Raise that back leg up. Again, just rise into your lunge. And hands to either side of the foot. Back foot comes forward. Meet me in forward fold. Shake your head out no and yes. Hands to shins, rise up halfway. Exhale down. Add the scripture verse. Come up in the mountain. For those of you who fear my name, the sun of righteousness will rise. Find that open back bend with healing in its wings. Arms rise again. Exhale and come forward. And you will go out like calves leaping from the stalls. Hands to shins. Rise up halfway. Exhale down. Leave the right leg where it is. Take the left leg back. Knee comes down. Deep breath in, rise up. Exhale. Hands to either side of the foot. This time, raise that back leg. Press into that left hand. Sweep that right arm up. Exhale, release. Front foot comes to the back. Meet me in plank. From plank, come down to the mat. Find your flow. Say the scripture verse. For you, those of you who fear my name, the sun of righteousness will rise with healing in its wings. And you will go out like calves leaping from the stalls. One breath here, check in. Deep breath in, left leg rises high. Gaze comes forward, foot comes all the way through, back knee drops. Come up and find your back bend. Inhale, rise. Exhale, hands to either side of the foot. Raise that back foot. Bring that left arm out and up, twisting to the inside of that front leg. And exhale, back foot comes up to the front. Meet me in forward fold. This time we're gonna add a chair pose into it. So hands to shins, rise up halfway. Exhale down. Hands come a little forward, lift the heels as the hips drop. Fingers come back to the little toes. Press the feet down as the hips rise. Anchor in, find your chair pose. 
Exhale, hands to heart. Bring those hands up, find mountain pose, find your back bend, arms are wide. Roll those shoulder blades around and under. Extended mountain, hands come together. Exhaling, forward fold. Hands to shins, rise up halfway. Exhale down, step into the right foot, left leg comes back, stay in your high lunge. Come up, cactus arms. Round those shoulders under, find your back bend. Deep breath in, say the scripture verse. For those of you who fear my name, the sun of righteousness will rise. Hands come to either side of that foot with healing in its wings. Sweep that arm out and up. And you will go forth like calves leaping from the stalls. Exhale, release. Front foot comes to the back. Find your way back to downward facing dog. So maybe it's chaturanga and upward facing dog. Maybe it's a low plank and sphinx pose. Meet me in downward dog. Find your breath. What do you notice? Deep breath in, left leg rises high. Gaze forward, foot comes all the way through. The hands rise into a high lunge. Say the scripture verse. For those of you who fear my name, rise up. The sun of righteousness will rise with healing in its wings. Come all the way forward, press into that inside hand left arm reaching out and up and you will go out like calves leaping like calves from the stall and exhale back foot comes forward forward fold hands to shins rise up exhale down go ahead and lift those heels as the hands come back Feet come down to the mat. Meet me in that chair pose. Say the scripture verse, rise up from here. And the sun, for those of you who fear my name, the sun of righteousness will rise with healing in its wings. Palms together and up, forward fold, and you will go out leaping like calves from the stall. And hands to shins, rise up halfway and exhale down and leave the left leg where it is and the right leg comes back and rise into your lunge and find your back bend. For those of you who fear my name, rise up. The sun of righteousness will rise with healing in its wings. Hands to either side of that foot, bring that other arm out and up and you will go out like calves leaping from the stall. And exhale down, front foot comes to the back. Meet me in Chaturanga, find your flow back, connect it to the scripture verse. For those of you who fear my name, the sun of righteousness will rise with healing in its wings. And you will go forth leaping like calves from their stall. Deep breath in, right leg rises high. Gaze forward, foot comes all the way through, rise into that lunge, find your back bend. Say the scripture verse, arms rise. For those of you who fear my name, the sun of righteousness will rise with healing in its wings. Fold over, press into that inside hand, outside arm rises, and you will go out leaping like calves from the stall and exhale and back foot comes forward and meet me in that forward fold and hands to shins rise up halfway and exhale down and find your chair pose and 
Rise up and find that back bend. Extended mountain hands to heart. Final mountain pose. I invite you to stay here and find your breath. Notice how your body has responded to the practice, the way the feet are connected to the mat. Noticing also the right side of the body compared to the left, or the beating of the heart, or the movement of the breath. One more breath here. Deep breath in, arms rise, exhaling, forward fold. And hands to shins, rise up halfway and exhale down and one leg back and then the other and meet me in plank. But this time, bring both knees to the mat, child to table twice, exhaling into child, inhaling to table. I invite you to come back to child's pose and stay here. Finding breath. How do you feel about fearing God? Where do you need healing in your life? Gently press into your hands and rise up. Come to, a, come to a seated position. Bring your feet wide. Gently let those knees tap down side to side. Just rock over the hips. And bring your feet forward. Come all the way down onto your back. Settle here for a moment, just noticing the results of the practice, noticing how the body has settled, finding breath. Gently bring the knees in and give yourself a hug. Rock side to side. Knees together. Go ahead and just circle the knees and the ceiling. Massage out the back. Release any remaining tension. Maybe reverse that circle. See what happens if you go the other way. As you're ready, gently draw the knees in and back, back and forth here. Bring the feet down, extend the legs long. Go ahead and windshield wiper your feet and bounce your knees. Reach those hands up to the ceiling as high as you can. Let the shoulders blades thump down. So you're just gonna drop those shoulders. No resistance, one more time. Let the hands come down softly to the mat, palms up, and turn your head side to side from the top of one ear up and over to the top of the other. Always, always moving within your own range of motion. Would you ready meet me in Shavasana? Acknowledging the holiness of God, his power and his authority. Asking for healing.
I invite you to stay here a little longer if you can. If you need to move on with your day, begin to bring movement back, wiggling fingers and toes, rotating wrists and ankles. Again, maybe turning your head side to side. As you're ready, take a deep breath in and bring those arms up and overhead and stretch. And then bending your knees, roll over onto your side and support your head. Take your time. As you're ready, slowly come up to a seated position, eyes closed if you're still comfortable with that. Finding your sitting bones. Check in one final time, body, mind, and soul. Noticing what has changed. Noticing also what has stayed the same. Noticing without judgment. On that next inhale, draw those arms up and overhead, palms together, and exhale, hands to heart, bowing your head, joining me in prayer. Holy and powerful God, forgive us for those times when we take you for granted, when we make assumptions and presumptions that we should not make. Thank you, Jesus for leaving heaven, for coming down to earth, for bridging the gap, for dying for us so that we can stand in the holiness of God. God, we humbly ask for healing, healing in all of the ways that we are broken. And we come to you today fully surrendered, knowing that your will and your ways are best. Jesus, it is in your name that we pray. Amen. Thank you for joining me today.